So we talked about the credit app in the past. The credit app, if you guys don't know, is a way for you to report your non-paying customers to the credit bureaus in order to get them to pay. So you don't have to hire a lawyer if your customers won't pay you. You just report them to the credit bureaus and they get a hit on their credit report until their invoice is paid. Easy as that. But how secure is the credit app? And also there are some other questions to be answered. Today on this video, let's, let's dig into the credit app and let's answer some common questions. Let's go. This video is brought to you by the credit app. Start reporting your delinquent customers to the credit bureaus just like the big guys. Before we jump in, if you haven't subscribed yet, make sure you're subscribed down below and also smash that like button for the YouTube algorithm. Just go ahead and tap that like button. It really helps for the YouTube algorithm to spread this video far and wide. So the more, the more people that see this video, the better. So just go ahead and hit that like button and then we'll be good to go. I can wait. See, you hitting it? You hitting it? All right, let's go. I'll give you a quick overview of Credit App, but if you really want, to know what it does, I would watch some of the past videos. Basically, customers, if you're an agency owner, customers not paying you is super annoying. But the problem is, if you want customers to pay you, you either need a whole collections department or a collections person to chase them down, you need to be aggressive with them over the phone, or worst case, you need to hire a lawyer to go after them. Very expensive, and the other ones require a hire, which you don't wanna make. The credit app is $40 to report your non-paying customers to the credit bureaus. Now you might be asking, is it worth spending $40 on a service to do this? And my answer is one, it's only $40, first of all. Second of all, imagine the pain the customer is going to feel when they have their unpaid invoice. Let's say they owe you $4,000, something too small to hire a lawyer to go after them about. They owe you $4,000, and now they can't get a mortgage because their credit is hurt until they pay your $4,000. Getting your money that you are owed is worth the 40 bucks. Yes, 100% of the time. So let's go through some FAQs here. What credit bureaus do they report to? All of their data goes to Equifax for immediate processing and then normally a month later, the other credit bureaus will pick up the data that's been reported to Equifax. It costs 40 bucks, you guys know that, or $49 per transaction, 49. What if I have a lot of orders to submit? Luckily, they have bulk order options for you. What do I have to tell a debtor to do after they paid their debt in full? If they wish to have the negative mark taken off their credit, then tell them to visit creditapp.org where they can upload proof of payment and have the mark removed or not reported in the first place if they pay on time. This is what's so cool. If they pay, they get it removed instantly. It's not like this negative mark follows them around forever. All they gotta do is pay you. This, as I've been saying in all these videos and why I like that the credit app bumped into us and sponsored a few of these videos is because it's so simple to get clients to pay you. Now it's only 49 bucks and you have something to hold over their heads to actually get them to pay their unpaid invoices. I think if we look at our unpaid invoices, there's gotta be. One time a guy paid for literally a full year's worth of our service upfront and charged back within like a week, $50,000, right? If we had the creditapp.org, we could hit his credit and make him pay that back. Beautiful, but actually 50K is enough for us to bring our lawyers. What states can you report in? We currently report in all 50 states. That's amazing. What are the requirements for the credit bureaus to accept a default? There must be a signed agreement between the creditor and the debitor. The debt must be a bona fide debt and legitimate. The debt must be 30 days past due. Who can report debt and who can I report? Any LLC or sole proprietor can report customer defaults through the credit app. If the contract was signed by a business, the debt must be reported as a business debt unless there's a personal guarantee in the contract. You can report the debt for any individual business or both in which they defaulted on a signed contract for goods or services in exchange for money. That's cool. So if a business signed your contract, you gotta report the business. So this is different from traditional debt collectors or attorneys because you're directly reporting them to the credit bureaus. An attorney, you'd have to pay thousands of dollars to do this. And a debt collector, you'd have to pay a percentage of the amount collected. All you gotta do for credit app is pay the $149 fee and they handle everything. And the reason why this works is people want good credit. You need a good credit score in order to get loans, in order to get good rates on your mortgages, in order to move into high quality housing. If it's personal credit, if it's business credit, it's gonna mostly be around loans if they need 
new equipment or new anything. They want to take out some loans. It's going to be harder if their credit sucks, et cetera. So people are going to be willing to pay their debt in order to raise their credit up. Nobody wants those bad marks on their credit, especially for relatively small amounts. Let's say they wanted to take out a million dollar loan, but their credit is making their interest rates so high and all they have to do is pay you back your $3,000. Of course, they're going to pay you back the $3,000 so that they can save you know hundreds of thousands of dollars on a large loan. It just makes sense. And what if debt is not owed and it's a wrong report? Well, the credit mark will be removed very easily if they just provide the details of the fact that they don't owe the debt, then credit app will remove it pretty simply. So even false reporting is taken care of. I like credit app. I think it's cool. I think you should check it out. Creditapp.org. Thanks for watching the video. Be sure to smash that like button to encourage this type of content on YouTube. Subscribe for more videos like this, and I'll talk to you soon. Thanks for watching. I'm Alex Berman.